This is Artifacts of Mars, and you're not going to believe this one. Town of Hempstead, New York, uh, went and raised this guy's house. His name is Philip Williams. He's a Navy veteran. They went and tore down his house while he was away recuperating from knee surgery. And they're completely unapologetic about it. He is suing them, and I hope he wins. There were apparently some problems with it, but... My God, you don't tear somebody's house down like that when they're... away. That's... Inf they're, that's completely infringing on their rights. Mortgage was up to date, property taxes were up to date, everything is current and fine. Also been brought to Hempstead officials Attention when neighbors complained about the residence built in nineteen twenties was in disrepair and blight on the community. You don't mind your own business. Inspectors then determined the house was a dilapidated dwelling and it was knocked down. They trespassed on this guy's property. They didn't bother finding out where he was. Uh, I'm not a lawyer, but I'd say he has a case. William says he believes the town officials thought his house was a zombie home, was dwelling abandoned after foreclosure proceedings began and rushed to demolish it. Tom basically took everything from me, he said Williams, who is now staying with a friend in Florida and has only two suitcases of belongings. Tom does not have a right to take all my property, all my possessions. Yeah, no fooling. Want to talk about mental disorder liberalism? Right here you go. Yeah, he had some problems with it. Williams is now seeking reimbursement for both the house and all the belongings inside and is followed. Filed a notice of claim first step in a lawsuit against Tom. He is also fighting for public records. He believes when he show what happened, his town, town officials won't tell him the name of the demolition company or the date when the house was torn down. Tom, in a statement, said it followed all the proper procedures with regard to proper property order notification. Bullshit. That is incredible bullshit. Williams has also contacted the police and asked their county district attorney's office and asked for a criminal inquiry. The spokesman from the district attorney's office said the matter is under review. You see, people who went through a tornado and floods, and they say they lost everything, but that's not preventable. This was preventable. They took my house. Well, I hope this guy wins his lawsuit and gets a fair settlement. I won't move back to that community at all. This is disgusting. You're not pissed off about this one, man. <laughs> you got some pretty, uh, cool blood, I'll tell you that much. Because my blood is on fire right now. It is boiling. I'm Artifacts Mars, proving once again that liberalism is a mental disorder. These are no doubt liberals. I can't believe they would just move in and take his house. Well, I believe it, knowing how this country is working now. I've All I'm going to say about coming to... Uh, Without giving out any information, as I've seen this before. That's all I'm going to say is, I've seen it before, so, uh... This is outrageous. I'm Artifacts Mars. This is the mental disorder of liberalism on parade.
They shit all over one of our veterans, and somebody's got to pay for it. If I get time Monday, I'm going to so rip those assholes a new one. Last time I called, I actually called New York City uh, area, and uh, it was a cab company that did a bad thing. No, it was, it was an ambulance company. It, it took them less than uh, 10 seconds to shunt me off to some number that nobody answered. That was another deal. Alright, well this is Artifacts of Mars. Thanks for watching. Call up the town of Hempstead and give them a ration of you-know-what. West Hempstead. Give them a ration of you-know-what and let them know that they're a bunch of lousy, good-for-nothing, dirty scumbags. I'm Artifacts of Mars.